So the Ballon d'Or Awards took place yesterday with Messi taking home the award for the eighth time. And there is a big discussion around if he truly deserved the award. So I'm going to break down the criteria for the award and let you guys have your say along with a few references. So one individual performances players are evaluated based on their individual performance during the calendar year this includes their contributions in matches for their club and national team such as goals assists defensive contributions and overall impact on the game two team success success with their respective club and national teams can also play a significant role Winning domestic league titles, continental trophies like the UEFA Champions League and international tournaments like the FIFA World Cup can boost a player's chances. Consistency. Consistency over the course of the year is crucial. Players who maintain a high level of performance throughout the year are often favoured. Sporting fair play. The behaviour of the player on and off the field can influence the voting. Fear play, sportsmanship, and avoiding disciplinary issues are valued. 5. Reputation. A player's reputation and standing in football world can also impact their chances. Previous achievements and how they are perceived by peers and the media matter. 6. Position. Historically, the Ballon d'Or has been awarded to attacking players more frequently than defenders or goalkeepers. However, outstanding performances by players in any position can earn them consideration. 7. Journalists and expert votes. The award is decided by a panel of international journalists, national team coaches and captains. They vote for their top choices based on these criteria and the player with the most votes wins the Ballon d'Or. Okay, so with that being said, you see Alan coming off the season that he came off with a lot of goals. Didn't have as much assists as Messi, but he had an impeccable season nonetheless. He won everything with Manchester City. Manchester City are currently the dominant team right now in club football. Okay, so... With this being said, we take a look back on Paul Nedved's award in 2002-2003 for Juventus. He won everything that season with Juventus and he was a player who played for a similar nation in the like of Czech Republic. Then we also can look to Andrei Shevchenko, who played for AC Milan in 2004 and won the Ballon d'Or. He came from a similar nation in Ukraine. And he did similar things with his club, AC Milan, like Alan.